My name's Yorick, and I'm pretty sure back there I stepped on a pile of human shit. We're stepping up. Moving all up. Been tank out crap. Oh, I don't really have a... I do have a long range gun. How about that? Plan to this gun strength. <laughs> yeah, I see you, jackass. <laughs> oh, what a celerity, guys. What is he, a Tory? Bruja? Doesn't matter. Stand up, come on. Well, that was a satisfying ash sound. I'm not get out of your head. You get out of my head. Oh, yeah. Oops, that was a miss. Oh, come on, you're supposed to be chasing me. You two have fun. Tasty, tasty gold blood. I, I assume. Now, the vampire's bite is supposed to be deeply euphoric. You suppose it's still true when I'm biting out their artery like that? I can't imagine I'm gonna make this. Nothing but the Ithacas. I mean, it's not a bad gun, it's just... You guys aren't keeping up the times. Ah, oh, blood bank. Do you suppose that this still terrifies them? With the ecstasy of the bite, I mean. Like, this has got to be, like, the highlight of the day. Getting real low on rounds. Huh. Now where to? Ah. Oh. What's up, gents? There can be only one. Come on, guys. Put your heart and soul into it. Hey, someone has a win. No. Well, damn, I was in the middle of eating that, do you mind? Oh shit, more presents. Getting kind of love on ammo, motherfucker. Let's take a little look at our gut selection. We may have to be dropping one. Uh, 
Yeah. Welcome back, old friend. Oldies and goldies. Shells. I might have to start relying on a bit of melee. Not really. Your dinner. Knock it off. Well, thank you. Close. Just get carried away. Oh my. Ah, damn. You too, fight to the death. Uh, wow, that is just a damage spell to the so That's unfortunate. As well, heal up while I'm setting the reload. Where to next? I feel like I'm on a hell of a roll. The fat Larry better be getting all of this on film. That's all I got to say. It's just a shade of creepy. There's a door. It doesn't open. Nope. I get the feeling this is pretty linear. Yeah, let's see what's behind door number one. Uh. Well, that's fucking disgusting. Maybe I should have waited until I actually needed that, but fuck it. Ugh, we're all on pinwheels. Oh, damn. 
I recognize the smell of your blood, young Knight. Very potent. Greater than our last meeting. I could smell it even over the flood of my fallen brethren. Doesn't that make you wonder? Hmm. What's a gilla? My ears hear not your dark devil. Puppet. The strength of your blood is all that saved you from yourself. Wretched, weak-minded mongrel. The blood is wasted in you. Wasted! Death has weighed you, and you are found wanting. Miserable, ignorant Cadaspor. You are blind. The sarcophagus must be destroyed. I wasn't even saying shit about that. Now I'm curious. Now the Dark Father has come. He rides my cab. He drives it, in fact. I will do it myself if I must. But you, you will be purified. It is the blood that he is speaking through. The blood of all the pawns. It all must be purified. Wow. This is like right up there with Harry Potter racism. Is he going to call me a mud blood next? Yours is the path to final sleep. And then he turns into that fucker. Oh, come on. Well. This is not fair. Ow, oh, damn. What is that? And I'm actually carrying enough melee weapons so that I can't pick it up. Go figure. Alright, now let's read what that is. This sword is forged by Telmira, a vanished sect of kindred that purportedly ventured into the lands of the dead. It seems unnaturally light and causes aggravated damage. Oh my god. Like, that's awesome, but... I mean, I'm just not a melee. Oh, if I was... If I was, like, a swordsman Ventru, I would be overjoyed right now. This thing causes aggravated damage. This guy is kicking my ass. Let's have a little bit of healing, shall we? I'm gonna go ahead and put that on a hotkey. This Baz is fine for now. Yeah, that's not fair. I set you on fire. I shouldn't have stood still. That was my fault. Not that it really seems to matter where I stand with this guy. Okay. This goes beyond kicking my ass. Wish I'd saved that flamethrower.
Oh, come on. Ah, it's doing the thing again where it's not... The buttons aren't doing what they should. God damn it. Getting sick of you. <sighs> Good for him. Oh, a torch. What else can I get rid of? I guess get rid of the Shinganto. I didn't think I'd actually be able to get rid of these. Check it out. If you're not, it's light. Neat. Nah, how do I get out of here? Be at peace, kindred. Hey, man. You stand amongst friends now. The Curlus Changs offered no helpful hands. Indeed. The Chang brothers, my greatest agents, undone by the young soldier of LaCroix. It was obvious your path was greater than I or he had anticipated. Legendary, you could say. What did the Lou liaisons with LaCroix? We did have an arrangement, LaCroix and I. A mutually beneficial pact to drive the lesser factions from the city. Hmm. Tell me your tale. LaCroix's zeal in recovering the Ankaran sarcophagus has been to the exclusion of many relationships, mine included. And I, like yourself, have been used by him in his desperate quest for power. Your tale lacks temerity. LaCroix feared Alistair Grout, the Malkavian Primogen, for the cursed insight of his bloodline was strong and brought him uncomfortably close to the truth about LaCroix's ambitions. Hey, something me and Grandpappy have in common. The ale of truth is downed ambitiously. LaCroix saw an opportunity to rid himself of two problems. A hardened rebel leader and a problematic primogen in one fell stroke. And as you can see, I was integral to his plan. Son of a bitch. Ah, the Mistress of Mirrors shows another of her faces. LaCroix convinced me that an alliance with a Camarilla could strengthen the position of the Kuei Jin. And so with my help, your prince framed Nines Rodriguez for the murder of Alistair Grout. That motherfucker. Strength you seek for what purpose? Our war with the Annex has taken its toll. A truce with the Camarilla allowed us to marshal our remaining forces and focus on a lone enemy. Why did your web become unwoven? Our dealings with LaCroix have put his integrity into question. 
He has become careless. His desire for the sarcophagus seems to have superseded all other concerns. Tell me about it. Political discretion. I built him at about 500 bucks for that thing. Walking onwards. It is obvious to me that he wishes to obtain it only so that he might use its power against those who would oppose him. If he betrays his own kind in these pursuits, can I trust him to honor our allegiances? Can you? All of these tales are terribly tangled. I leave you. Hear these words, kindred. The sarcophagus is sealed against the ages. Only the proper key will break this seal. That key now lies safely in Huijin hands. Your prince's prize cannot be had without it. Well, in the words of um, Hagrid, you shouldn't have told me that. Fate is often a perilous puzzle. I hope you recognize my sincerity, kindred. I would like to see you reach your destination before your path is cut short. I hope when next we meet, it is again as friends. I am no longer here. I am in desperate need of blood, low on ammunition, and coming up on the timer. So, well, that was fun. The fiend kicked our ass. Like, seriously. Oh my god, I thought he was going to kill me. All of us. He would have killed all of us. Because you're here with me in my mind. Look into these dark skies with me. And know that next time we'll be standing right here. Farewell, vampire.